welcome back to my channel. My name is Shay. I am a full-time reseller on Poshmark, eBay, and Macari. I am Tyler, part-time seller on Poshmark, Macari, eBay. Did you forget? No, I was just deciding which order to go. <laughs> um, and today's video is a haul video. Woo! We don't do enough of those. We do all of them. <laughs> oh. Um. Yes. Yeah, so uh, for those of you guys who don't know, I am kind of ish working in this time period. So we're not sourcing as much because I don't have time. And yeah, we're also not listing as much. So that we, is- We're not listing as much. Whose job is that? We're a team. Uh, yes. Yeah, so we are a little bit behind on things. So we do have kind of a big haul because we've not been listing. So yeah, so you guys get to see it before it goes up. So if there's anything you are interested in here, please let me know in the comments down below because they are not listed, but I can always get you guys And a she deal. will give it to you for basically cost. Yeah, and I can do it through PayPal or anything like that. So do yeah. let us know down below. Um, also, if you guys like reseller content and you want to see more haul videos, unboxings, what sold videos, all that type of thing, make sure you subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell so you're notified every time I post new videos. We post new videos every Sunday and Wednesday. Yeah, I think we got a couple of good things in here too. I think if I remember correctly, there's a couple of new to us things. Yeah, there's some interesting stuff. So make sure that you stay till the end of the video. And it's all of the pants. Oh, all of the pants. I love pants. So right out the gate, starting strong with seven for all mankind. Pants size 36. I don't know the style. They're not dojos. They're not dojos. Um, I actually picked these because they are men's, I believe. And when I looked them up, they I uh, figured that they would do pretty well. Um, but yeah, I don't know much about them. Seven for All Mankinds, I sometimes will buy not dojos if they're cheap enough and these were. So, you know, they do sell. They just don't sell for as much as dojos. Yeah, all of the dojos. Uh, free People, size 31. More pants. So, Free People. Free People jeans, we have a very hard time grabbing because they always are up priced at the thrift store. The only thing I can think of with this is that maybe they just didn't notice the tag. Uh, these are cropped jeans. Uh, but they are really cute, so hopefully they will sell. There is a little bit of a snag right here on the front, just so. I think that's designed better. I do not think so. Just so you guys know, in case you are interested. No, oh, maybe not. <laughs> oh. More pants. Uh, these are AGs. Size. Some right there, twenty nine R, I believe. Twenty nine R. Yeah. So these nice. are Moto. Black stretchy jeans. Yeah, these are the Moto jeans. Let's see the color there. But I like these a lot. I, I like this style. So an AG seems to do pretty well for me. Um, they, it sit a little bit, but they do really well. They do better on Macari than any other platform. Uh, these are cut from the cloth, which most people don't pick up. But I mean, if you can get them for a decent price, they're definitely worth it. And look at the butts. Look at the butts. That's why I picked it up. The butts. Uh, the butts. Uh, so these are size 8. Which is my size. So, yeah. And yeah, I picked it up from the butt. Um, hem looks pretty good. Minimal, so, minimal wear. Yeah, so, so good price. They'll probably do pretty well. Uh, those sell pretty good on eBay. Uh, so, more pants. AGs, the Moto. Yeah, so Again. these are Moto, I think they're Zip Hem, right? Yeah, yep. they're Zip Hem. You see those? Uh, these are a darker color than the other ones. They have zip pockets. Uh, and here you can see the style here. Yeah. They're also yeah. stretchy. Did we say the size on these? I don't think we did, which is 27R. So, yeah. First non pants thing, go us. Okay. Uh, these are Minnetonkas. Yeah, so this is a brand I'm still learning. I don't actually know how well they do. Um, I haven't had great luck myself, but I've heard a lot of uh, resellers like selling them, and I thought these were pretty classic that they might uh, they do to be a decently. Size eight. Yeah, and they're pretty good shape. So a little bit of a suede brush, and I think they'll be almost new. Oh no, these are fantastic shape. Yeah. Which is a nice change of pace because apparently the people living around us abuse the hell out of shoes. <laughs> this is very it's, true. It's brutal yeah. seeing some of the shoes that you would normally pick up. Uh, this is Cole Haan men's. medium. It's got to be a men's. Yeah. Uh, it's a nice like sweater jacket. We mostly just like the style. I don't actually pick up Cole Haan clothing like at all. I don't think I ever have. I'm not even sure if I have. Um, but there's the tag there. I don't know if you can see it because of the price tag. But 
Um, yeah, it's it's really cute. It has a mock neck. It's zipper up. A great heavy duty fabric. Yeah. So. so I mean, we liked the style. We don't sell full hung clothing, so we don't know much. So if you do know anything, do let us know in the comments. But uh, I think I'd give it a shot. I think it's a worth solid the tool. try. All right, back to our wheelhouse. These are pants. <laughs> Uh, it's by Anthropology, size 14. These are like corduroys, button They're front? like button front, high-waisted corduroys. They're also look to be a little bit cropped, the too, at the bottom, wide leg crop. Yeah, wide leg crop, maybe, so. maybe pedal pushers or something? I'm not really sure what you'd call them, but I don't know. They're very strange, but... They're a nice color. They're, they're corduroy, and... And I think someone will want them, so... Pants are my wheelhouse, so. She does sell a lot of pants. These are Eileen Fisher linen pants. Hmm. Shocker. Uh, Elastic waistband. Uh, yep. SP. So small yeah. petite. So this is the type of things people are looking for right now. They're comfy. Um, it's it's lightweight, so we are moving into spring. So I think that comfy comfy clothing is moving into. We are comfy. all still going to be in quarantine. Yeah, so. but it'll be comfy lightweight rather than comfy sweatpants. So. Uh, only bag of the trip. So this we is, don't find bags often. This is a coach bag. Uh, so it's got that wonderful worn-in leather kind of look. So yeah. it, it's got that uh, texture, or not texture feel, but it's very soft Distress. leather. But it's got the distressing around it, which adds to the yeah the aesthetic to me. You can see the branding got, on the buttons here. It's got some great brass hardware as well. There you go. Now, I don't pick up Coach very often. I don't pick up bags very often, honestly, but uh, Coach, I don't really like the monogram logo all over it, so I won't pick that up just because I really just don't like it. It really bothers me. Um, but that type of bag I really like. It doesn't seem to be um, in our thrift stores very often. I think people snatch those up. But that one, I think people may have thought it was damaged, um, but from the pictures I saw online, they it is a distressed look, and we'll wonder bomb it to see if we can give it some new life, too. So these are the new to us to try. Uh, these are Nikes. And this was actually found in a Goodwill, which we do not frequent uh, Goodwills. Um, <laughs> yeah, we actually went to the Goodwill for... For hard goods. Hard goods. Yeah. But, which um, we sucked at. So these are Nike Max Air. Uh, I did look it up through the style number. I can't remember what I saw, but I, I think $80 was... Se 70 80 bucks or yeah. so. so I'm, the, the worst part of them are the, the discoloration on the white part on the sole, but it should clean up very well. Now these are size 10 and a half. Are we assuming men's just based on looking at them? Uh, yes, because okay. they would almost fit me. Okay, so again, I don't know much at all about sneakers. I know nothing about Nike. So if you know anything, do let us know. We are going to clean them up, of course, because they are a little bit dirty. They're actually not horrible, I mean, but there is some... It's a little bit scuffed up, but that's not a big deal because that'll come right out. Yeah. The soles are in decent shape. There's a little bit of wear on the corners, but... Right. But we wanted to try them, see how they do. Um, it's a learning experience. Um, more pants? More pants. Oh, shocker. Uh, these are Lucy sweatpants, size medium. So I did actually sell, I don't, I think it was one of my past videos. I don't know which one, but I had talked about trying Lucy it again. It was trying Lucy. It was the what came home versus what? Oh, the card analysis. Yeah. Okay. So in that, I had picked up a green Lucy sweatshirt and I said, I don't know anything about Lucy's tops, but I want to try it. And it sold within the same day on eBay. So that's a good sign. So if you don't, Those might, you these might also have been part of that video. Yeah. I have no idea. I don't know. Pro probably. Lucy Power. We're, we're that lazy. Yep. Uh, size medium. Uh, and uh, there we it's go. got a nice wide leg on the bottom. Yeah, they're pretty nice. So we'll see how they do. Again, I don't know a lot about Lucy, but that was a pretty good indication for me. I was kind of happy I picked it up. All right. Uh, more pants. Pants. Again. Uh, these are by Anthropology 29s. The Wanderer. They've got a nice... Yeah, like little cargo type cargo, pockets. Cargo vibe. It's a canvasy type material. Yeah. So another anthro. Um, I don't know much about the Buy Anthropology brand. We have kind of mixed bag luck with that. Um, but I think they're really cute. So hopefully they do decently. And 29 is not a bad size. And almost last, these are more pants. <laughs> Buy Anthropology, again, there's like six of them. 
Size 30, these are a linen-y cargo pant type thing. Yeah, so elastic waistband, so the comfy vibe, and we got the light weight again, so it's bright season pockets, you always want pockets. Everybody right wants pockets. There you go. What size was I? 30. 30. So, I mean, this could be the same person who was offloading their anthropology stuff. It's 29, 30, they're not that far apart. And then lastly, lastly, not pants, uh, we have shoes. These Miss are Moon. Ms. Moose. So Miss Moose is actually one of the first like higher end brands that we found at the bins. And it didn't go very well because they were not in great shape. No, these they were are actually right. in decent shape. There are is problems on the toes there. I don't know if you can the see. The toe should clean up a little bit. But these are really cute. Um, I forget what brand Miss Moose is part of. I want to say Prada, but I don't remember I think, off the top of my head. I think so. I'm not sure. These are seven and a half, by the way. Seven and a half. So, I mean, these are in much better shape than the last ones that we sold. Hopefully, they do well. They've I think nice, they're really like, cute. Classic nice look. suede around the top and the rivets. And it's really, really soft leather on the outside. Yeah. It'll it'll take the Wonder Bomb very well. They should look basically new. Yeah, and they were a good price. So hopefully they do well for us. But yeah, I'm really excited about these. We don't sell shoes often enough. I find like they do sell, but we always get these damaged ones that like. Just I think sit. our problem is that a lot of around here, especially in the winter when you wear them, is the salt gets yeah. on the shoes and it just stains and it's just awful. Yeah, we're really more of a pants kind of. Kind of oh no, yeah, it's, it's pants all, all the time. <laughs> uh, yeah, so that is it. That is what we have today. Um, I'm hoping we'll be back with a haul soon, but again, we're not going to the thrift store that often, so I can't make any promises. Make her do, go Wednesday. I do have a Joe Mar box coming. Ooh. Yeah, so there is a Joe Mar outerwear box coming. It's kind of sad that it's taken as long as it has. It's been over a month, and outerwear will kind of be out of season by the time it gets here. Um, but there's nothing I can do about that. That, that is what it is. Um, so we'll talk about that when that comes, but, uh, that's all I have. So if you guys like this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. It really helps let YouTube know that this is a video that you should be watching. So stepping in, if you like this type of contact, please like, and subscribe. It really helps us out with the YouTube, uh, knowing that it's something that is interesting and valuable so that they promote it to more people. Uh, and that's it. So thank you guys very much for watching. We'll be back really soon with a new video. Thank you all for watching.